Hey everyone! So, I was stupid and forgot to hit record, but let me just quickly go over what I already did, because I am an poop. Oopsie! Not the first time it's happened. Anyway, I will be going over um, Molita that I had gotten from Uwolo. I love them so much. Alright, let's get into it. I will show everything on my dress form and I'll do and I'll do up close of all the little accessories. And yes, also just a side note, one of the dresses makes me think of Yang Li from The Untamed or Mo Dao Zushi, which I love her so much and I love Oh my gosh, I love that series so much. I love it so much that I am soon going to be taking Mandarin lessons and then I will know how to do towns and that will be great. Here is the first one. This one is called The Garden Party. It has a lot of lotus motifs and it's purple and it reminds me a lot of Yan Li. I had gotten this before I watched uh, The Untamed. So it's just kind of a little funny coincidence. Right there in the center, that is natural jade. They can vary on color since they are natural. Mine just happened to be that color. Little pom pom on the bow is really cute and soft. I'm not sure exactly what it's made out of, but I know that's how it clips on. Yeah, they're really cute, and there's that elastic for your arm. Just the fabric is very nice and light. It'll work really good for the hot weather, which I get too frequently here. And then this one right here is called a peach blossom. This is the blouse. Those are very dainty little clasps. It took me a minute to figure out how to actually uh, set them. And I'm not even going to try fully taking that out because then I wouldn't be able to put it back with one hand. But yeah, the little details are so nice. Little loose threads here and there are normally a common thing when you buy a Lolita from Taobao or anywhere in China really. They just make the make the clothing so fast. And it's hard to keep track of each tiny little thing. I don't mind much because I have little tiny scissors to clip those off. And I'm used to stuff like that, so I don't mind too much. And there's the... oh. And then there is my thumb. I had to cut my nail because I... it was... I had a hangnail and I didn't want to rip the delicate fabric. I didn't fully zip that up because I just didn't want to struggle. 
especially with my thumb hurting. And there's more of the nice embroidery. Another one also had um, some embroidery on it, which I really like how they do that. It's very nice and clean. Nice and soft. I like the choices of fabrics. They're very nice and intricate and there's a tag, I don't know what it says because it is in Chinese. But there's a lot of, there's a good amount of shirring in the back, so it'll be, it should be able to fit uh, chest. Mm. Those pearls, that little overskirt attaches. So that's that's pretty neat. Then I love how that's kind of like two giant petals. There's like the little jacket. The jacket also has really good embroidery on it. Can keep you warm. The little fur is nice and soft. It's just a trim. And then here's the little things that were dangling on the overskirt. I didn't want to take off the plastic encasing just to keep them all nice and tidy. That's a and then here's a piece that you can put in your hair. And then here's the third one. This is called Illusory Dream. It has nice fur cuffs. And nice and lightweight. There's cute little buttons and then there are nice little... I forget what they're called, but I'll call them clasps, and then you can make it look nice with the with the knots. And little tiny bows, they're so cute. And that's it done up. And then there is the JSK on top. It also has a fur trim. And the beadwork and the lace is just so pretty. The straps have shirring and so does the back. There isn't much of a back because it's more like wearing a sack. And then those little buttons there, they will attach onto the dress since this is the overskirt and there's it all on there's a little hair piece just cute little pieces Then here is the bracelet that goes with it. I really enjoy getting things from Uwowo. They have a lot of good stuff and also just pretty much anything on Taobao in general too. They tend to be pretty good quality for the most part, as long as you know what you're looking for. But with Uwowo, they are pretty good quality and I've been shopping with them for quite a while now <laughs> Thank you. 
anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much. Bye!